Yo, welcome back everybody. Today we have gameplay from Doc Holiday, And this one, this one right here is my favorite game of the patch. It's the beauty that is a meta that has non-ridiculous massive polarization in the middle of the game. Because when you don't have something and you're like, holy crap, I'm going to die, I'm going to die, I'm going to die, scramble roach. And you have the ability to successfully do that. It makes the game so much more interesting. Instead of it being like, oh, we didn't hit. I guess we'll die. Go next. And then you look for those little pivot lines. Turn an eighth into a sixth, into a fifth, into a fourth, into a third. You get the point I'm going for here. But these Rochi metas can be really, really, really high skill expression. And sometimes even leave you in a position where you can even take home the crown. All right. Enjoy. You're really good, right? You can be really good. We got it. We got a test. You can be absurd. And you can be terrible. Classic. Do we hear a power turn one? Almost always. Is it just me or is there nowhere near enough scam in the game? Yeah, I've had that opinion too. When Murlocs aren't in, it feels like it's it's a race to critical mass of stats. Though I'm not sure if that's really scam at fault. I mean, it's partially scam at fault. But it's also like, there's still a, a few abusable ways of getting really far out of bounds in terms of total stats. Fell Blood being the, the primary one. So, like, it's hard to balance one without the other. A Band-Aid's to have a lot of scam. What? This is, like, the worst one. All I did was... Average Snake Eyes turn one? Yeah. <laughs> hey! That's not the one I want. Give me a minion for two gold, and then I get to buy the spell. Or at least just double buy spells, right? That's the do nothing button right there. Hey, we, we scaled fungus for later. Think about it. Yeah. And now we've turned one gold into two gold. We're improving. Pure power last turn was one gold for one gold. Now it's two gold for one gold. I had a game with this guy where I had max nine gold on turn four. With this guy. You just like went to two, hero powered, got oil. Then on three, you got oil and then bought an oil. And then turn four, you got oil. How would you get nine on four though? Like I could see the max being an oil this turn. Two oils next turn. And that's only three. I can see seven. <laughs> you just need three oils. Oh, true. Four, you have six gold base. Yeah, yeah, never mind. What am I saying? Yeah, it makes sense. Just oil, oil, oil. It's just oils for days. Well, see you guys on three. I don't know. Feels a little bait. <laughs> oh, you totally want to go three on three. Come on, LaVancha. Oh, you know you want to get up here. Oh, you know you're coming. He did not love him. It's a tragedy. How do we get four gold from our hero power next turn, though? I don't know. Let's find out. I see. Looking rough? Not really. This is like, this situation is not a bad game. We just happen to have a lot of, you have to use health as a resource early on. I'd rather be in this position than like buying bad two stars. Tis what it is. Why do we only get one cost spells though, Bofer? I don't know. My minions are, my, my hero power is being dumb. Damn. Fully expected to take eight to 10 here. So like normal. 
now we got to connect. Okay, game. You're being rude. You're just being rude. I keep hero powering and getting things I wouldn't buy in the tavern for one gold. Got a hooktail. Got a early slimy. Not the good fell blood. We got a billion gold next turn. You fucking stop it. It's getting really old, Bob. This is getting real fucking old. It's getting real old over here. At least we have our really cool Soul Rewinder backstage security synergy. Get apples. Apples is just do nothing, give attack with Hooktail at this point. We can't afford to hold it back. Especially not against the snake eyes who stayed down a tavern tier into us. Every person in the lobby on tavern four, snake eyes on tavern three. Great. Exactly what I wanted to fight this turn. Apparently he's also weak and pathetic, but... But there's that. Totally what I wanted to fight this turn ends up being a decent matchup. How's he so weak? I don't know. Maybe he skipped a turn. This time for sure. Hold my beer, says Bob. Wait just one damn moment. Right now, it's give me demons. That's pretty good. Always want this card. I really want to buff its attack. All right, bizarre. I don't think we really care about this. Be something we can do with. With demons, I'm sure. Okay, now you're just kind of trolling. I'm not really sure what's happening over here. Three pirates is also swabby. Okay, but pirates is good too. Hmm. Okay. I like it. I think it's the end of the hooktail. The hooktail saved our ass this game. What a card. Okay. Our hits are abysmal though. Okay. Okay, Bob. Let's just lose the 20% or two. That's a lot of low rolls in the same game. You go Baron. Could also just go Felbor. 
We go Baron, we go away from demons. We go for spells and divine shields and play Nightbane. I don't think I care about this. Not enough to take it. Oof. This is good. The three-star Murloc with Avenge Bug, the Magnetic with the Death Rattle died and it proc twice instantly. Haven't seen that before. Maybe. Could be Bug. Is this thing bugged where it only hits the same minions over and over again? <laughs> Haven't seen that one before now either, but maybe. <laughs> There's six minions on the board. It triggered eight times and only hit two of them. <laughs> Wait a second. Probably just coincidence. Nice use of Bizarre Dealer. Still want it. Stupid card. No, these are not. Yes, yes, you. Yes, good. Yes. All right, moving in the right direction. You get out of here. You get out of here. Well, best of luck, my really cool board. Let's go. Now, this is what I call scaling. Hey. It's a lot of attack off of Nate Bane. We didn't have direction this game. We were in a pretty big pit. We're going to try to make something work out of nothing. And we got a lot of power really quickly. This cleave is very rude. Or cleaves, plural. Could be worse. Could be worse. Can I be happy though? No. No happiness allowed. We can only complain in this channel. No happy, only madge. Imagine you need health on your board. Yeah, true. Go for the smart line. I'm doing my best. We're trying to do the smart, okay? It's not really the undead board I thought we'd be fighting. Nice. Perfect. All the minions have attack. Could be worse. Could be better. Could be better. Could be worse. That was the 50-50 we needed. That was not. Madge. All right, fair enough.
Coin flip fail again. A lot of coin flips missed this game. Hey, it's a ghost. You have a level five? I think we're level five. This guy's trivial. Lass? Nala seems terrible. Could pick up the card before like there's a there's a big problem there. But like if you wanted to try to play the swabby before leveling, you have to hero power before leveling so you don't have access to five stars. Or you have to give up the buff on the unit that's you know is gonna be on the board double. I don't like doing that ever. I like that order. I think it's still fine. Just you gotta lose in one way or another. Why not Kel'Thuzad? Why do you want Kel'Thuzad? Or more attack on our board? Oh my god. We'd be so strong. No KT because it's not the Wii. I mean the Wii gives us access to more minions. Which is what we need. We need to get out of this next turn. And go all in on one more turn. One more round to stay alive. Because we want all the attack? I, I hear you, but like, I don't need more attack. Kel'Thuzad's not going to do shit. Attack is the least of our problems at the moment. What else do we do? We get more minions on the board. Higher relevance minions. Look for resets for Deflecto. We look for gold a minion of Tavern Tier 4 below so that we can gold this ahead of time or this. Not this. But like the, the reset or another deflecto or whatever it might be. You ain't winning the game off of making 50 attack and 100 attack minions into 200 attack minions. It does nothing at all to contribute to the future of the, the round, the future of your game. We just play to beat the next guy. Mechs. Not my favorite matchup. Where were you all game? Is there a six I want? Cleave? Probably not. No, it's just too expensive. This is nuts. Yes, you. You, sir. You. But wait, we could do that like three times. Okie dokie. Looks like we're getting there here. He got his reset. Too little too late though. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Dug ourselves out of this, this shitty asshole. Die, 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 top three. Okay, you know, I'll take top four. It's not that bad. I can live with that. We got perfect hits. Perfect tits. 
We did an astounding 12 damage on an 8 to 15 on a 98 percenter. Flawless victory. How do we cook? Pretty good. Not sure what's in the box, but surely it won't be scary. No reset for Deflecto, but uh, got there. Good enough. You Gucci? I, I like it. I like the line. We got ourselves out of the fucking pit, and we get positive points out of this bullshit. Look at our board. It's so bad. But it's my bad shit. I'll tell you what. This is so weird. Hey, not every game is a high roll. It's one of the things that like... I would have just died at the end of last season instead of doing this. Like, Meme Bofer didn't play for tempo. Meme Bo Bofer just died and went for another high roll the next game. I, I ain't having any of this shit. <laughs> Me right now, though, very different story. Figure it out. Try to find a way to, to get out of any of the bad situations. Any situation is recoverable, typically. Of course, that is if we get past this goose, too. There's a real chance you could always die with this board, because, like, there's no guarantee our procs go in good places. They're, you know, you could just get screwed over. Yeah, good hit there, though. I've seen worse. I've seen worse. Let's go. Die. Honestly, never a doubt. Easiest second place of my life. I wasn't even worried. You guys were the ones that were worried. Surely it wasn't me that was worried this game. All right, well, mission accomplished. <laughs> Pack it in, boys. We're going home. <laughs> Pack it in. We did We did exactly what we needed to do. First place incoming? Nah, it's not likely first here. We just had to dig ourselves out. But finding a way to turn bad games into second place is a huge portion of most metas. It just wasn't part of, of quest meta. Quest meta was like, just high roll the shit out of the game. 
That's not really what most metas are like. No. Oh, I couldn't dab it, dog. No. All right, anyway. Moving on with my life. Good luck. I mean, it was entirely a damage control game that we played. We were supposed to get 7th or 8th that game. We had nothing early. We played entirely damage control. We don't play for first. We did exactly what we were supposed to do.